Uh, so these are from um, the football, the football power index, ESPNs. Browns now have a six percent chance to make the playoffs. Thirteen best, thirteenth best odds in the AFC. Uh, even more frightening, they now have a twenty-one point nine percent chance that their first-round pick lands in the top five. And just so we all remember. That first round pick goes to the Houston Texans as part of the Deshaun Watson trade. Um, so again, that gives you an idea of how dire it is right now for the Browns as far as this season goes in this game against the Bengals. Yeah, there's no doubt. I mean, you know, I don't know exactly what metrics they use for the FPI, but you don't need to have an advanced degree to figure out that two and five is really bad, right? When you're trying to make the playoffs, and if you continue on that path, yeah, that's how you get a top five draft pick. So. Something needs to change, and something needs to change before Deshaun Watson comes back, right? It can't be, well, it doesn't matter, and Watson's going to win five games, and therefore there will be a middle of the pack, um, if not in the playoffs. I just don't think you can assume that for a guy that hasn't played in 700 days, and you know how it goes at the end of a season. If if you're out of the playoffs, guys get hurt, guys have surgery. So they need to keep this thing uh, – if it's still on the rails, then they need to keep it on the rails because um, – it could get bad. It could get ugly. Things could, you know, you know how it goes. Dave, you get the buy. People wonder if anybody's going to lose a job. Um, that's just how it goes when the season starts really poorly, especially when there are expectations for this team. Yeah, and, and the expectations, again, were, you know, keep it at 5-6, and 6-5, six, six and 7-4, and four, and then Deshaun Watson comes in and you're a playoff team. And um, it may not – be possible by the time Deshaun Watson gets back to to get to where you need to get um, to make the playoffs.